we go down the street, go here, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got it, boss. All right. Oh. I don't. I don't fucking believe it. What are you doing to my home, man? What are we doing to your home? Yeah, man, I live here. Squatter's rights, bro. You gotta go. Squatter's rights, my ass. You gotta, you gotta leave, man. I ain't, I ain't gotta leave. We got permits to work on this place. Oh, you gotta go, man. No, no, we don't gotta go. You gotta go. We got permits to work on this place, man. You're not, sir, you're not authorized to be using that hammer. Put go, the... go, 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 go. You gotta go. Put the hammer down. No. Go, 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 go. Come on. I don't believe this shit. Hey, yo, put the hammer down, man. No, I want you to leave my home. Sir, you're, you're drunk and homeless, and we're here to do some repairs, man. Oh, you're drunk and homeless. From I the, have a job. From the I'm looks of it, I think. Right now. From the looks of it, I think I am the one with the job, and you don't. No, I got the hammer. You, you need to get out of here, man. Get out of here. Phone. You're a phony. Oh, I'm the phony. Yeah. yeah we'll, well, we'll see about that phony. Hey, yo, what are you doing with my truck, man? I'm, I'm fixing it. No, you, you need to, listen, you need, you need to get out of here. Uh, uh, I'm, 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 I'm fixing it, man. 911, what is your emergency? Uh, yeah, so I... Yeah, how can I help you? Yeah, I'm the, I'm a foreman here. I'm at the abandoned motel. My name is Jethro Lucas, all right? And uh, there's a homeless drunk man here trying to do work, and we've got permits to work on this place and do some restoration for the city of Sandy Shores. All right. And and, so there's a homeless man there. Yeah, he appears to be drunk, and he's—I've I've asked him to leave several repeated times, and he just won't—he won't leave. And he's—he's he's trying to do work and use our tools. He's not permitted to be using our tools. He's not permitted to be here at this time while we have our permits. All right. So you would like him uh, trespass? Well, I, we don't. I don't really run the Bantam Motel. You see, we're just okay. here doing restoration for the for Sandy Shores, trying to do some construction work and repair. All right. But I've yeah. got yeah. 
LEO is en route. Can you like give me a description of the man? Yeah, he's about um he's he's a white male. Um wearing wearing all orange clothes, got a big backpack and a mask on his face. Can't tell what he looks like in the face and a, and a black and a black uh, looks like a do rag. All right. You said black do rag? Yeah, that's correct. All right. Elio is en route. Are you uh, are you local there? No, oh, I am not. I am a resident. I I used to be homeless myself. I understand this man, what he's trying to do, but I got me some work, you know, and working in construction. I'm a foreman on this site. All right. Uh, when Elio arrives, would you be able? To, would you want to talk to him? All right. Okay. All right. Elio is on the way. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Did you call in a uh, disturbance? I did, sir. Thank you for coming. Sure thing. What's going on here? Uh, so I'm the foreman. I'm do. I got permits here. You see, to work, do some restoration and help with the abandoned motel. We're trying to do some construction. All right. And this this gentleman come over here messing with the construction stuff and trying to, you know, be around while we're trying to do work. And obviously, okay. he don't have any right to be here. I mean, he has a right to be wherever he wants. But right now, at this time, it's just a safety violation. If he gets hurt, we're not. You know, we're not to be held responsible, but that's on him. But at the same time, sure. I don't want the safety violations. Okay. All right, it's like going to be him up there in the red yeah, shirt. Yeah, that's, that's going to be him, yes. He appear, he does appear intoxicated. I've tried repeatedly to try to tell him, hey, you need to leave okay. because you don't need to be... make contact with him. You want to go ahead and talk to this guy. You don't want to need to yeah. be using tools and stuff. Sure, okay. When you're, when you're not, you know, you're not uh, certified to be using the utility trucks, dumper and all that, hammers and tools. You know, that's for our workers to use. And did he touch any of that? Yeah, he did. He sure did. He touched my utility truck over here and touched my dozer. Okay. Did he use them at all? Just touch them? Kind of explain to me what he did. He touched the... I remember I remember him grabbing the hammer. I see him grabbing the hammer. I said, put the hammer down. What? I was like, what the hell are you doing? Okay. And uh, uh, what is your first and last name, sir? Uh, my name... I go by Jethro. My last name, Lucas. I used to be homeless like this man. I understand where he's coming from, but at the same time, I've got me a job. I'm trying to do my work. Yeah, absolutely. Congratulations on turning that life around. Oh, uh, absolutely. Can I, just, can I just spell that first name for me real quick? Yeah, that first name's going to be J, and then E-T, like Jet, and then you in, you add the H-R-O, like Jethro. Perfect. That's what I thought. I appreciate it. Um, well, to the best of my knowledge, this is a condemned building, actually, so no one's supposed to be here aside from your construction crew. Of course, so correct. We'll, uh, yeah, we we'll got permits. We got permits from Sandy Shores within the city limits, where at least right here to be able to do work here and do some restoration. Okay, excellent. I will. Uh, we'll go ahead and make contact with him. Get him out of here. I appreciate your time. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Yes, sir. I tried to get these cones out of the way for you fellers, but they uh, just weren't. They weren't doing what they were. They weren't doing what they were told. Neither was he. Ah, uh, no worries.
Dale Barton. Yeah. You know, it's, it's Jethro. Hey, listen, you know, we got we got the homeless man down here, you know, trying to mess with the work. And I know we got all the permits and everything, but uh, I got the officers here trying to take care of him and talk to him and see what's going on. Yeah, you remember when I was homeless and he gave me that job? Yeah, you said you were one city slicker and you, uh, you, you, you said I was smelly as hell when I came in the work, but now look at me. I'm all showered up and working for you. Well, anyway, I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll let you go, but they're, uh, they're getting him all straightened out, I hope so, anyway. But I want to give you a call let you know what's going on. Alright, thanks. Bye. <laughs> I have been drinking, but I had eight beers. <laughs> <laughs> Seems legit. Live everywhere. <laughs>
was your name? My name's Jethro. All right, Jethro, one second. All right, Jethro, what's your last name? You don't mind if I uh, light up a cigarette while we're talking, do you? No, go right ahead. All right, give me just a second. All right, my name's yeah, my name's Jethro Lucas. Okay, is that L U C A S? That's correct. Okay, Jethro. So you uh you asked the gentleman um repeatedly fired as as Nicky Thompson. You asked him to leave right away. Uh, right away, as soon as I seen him, I was telling my I was telling my uh one of my workers over there to get started on that bulldozer, and as soon as uh. Because we weren't going to do too much. We just want to do some restoration for the, you know, the town of Sandy Shores. You yeah, know, definitely. for sure, this place is abandoned. We'll make it look a little better and get things going. But uh, anyway, yeah, I told him repeatedly. I said, hey, you need to get out of here. I was real nice about it because I recognized him. I used to be homeless like him. Right. And then I, then I said, no, what the hell are you doing now? Are you grabbing the hammer? And he started working on shit, you know, started beating on the bulldozer, beating on, you know, my truck, my utility truck. I don't know what he was doing here with the uh, the mixer here, but I seen him around it too, so I'm not really too sure what he was doing. But he looked like he was banging around on it. Okay, so do you, do you yeah. want him charged for for stealing the hammer? Cause he did drop it over there where we were talking to him. No, I don't want him charged for stealing the hammer, but I want him I want him charged for causing damage to our construction company worker vehicles. Okay, I so property damage. Okay. All right, so um. Do you need my permits or anything? Do you need to see my paperwork? I've got it all up, uh, laid out here on the hood of the truck. Um, I don't, I don't think so. Um, okay. Just in case, I went ahead and grabbed it from my utility truck while you all were dealing with him. Yeah, if you got all your permits and everything, I mean, we haven't received any complaints that there's, you know, construction equipment here. So. Right, right. I believe that you're you're here as you're supposed to be. Um, so and he's not like a former employer or anything like that. Oh no, heavens no, he's just. He was just a good friend back when I used to live on the streets. Okay, so he does know you then, okay. Yeah, now look at he... me, I'm a foreman. Right, yeah, you, know, you can always bring yourself up, right? You really can, you really can. I used to, I, listen, I used to, be, like, ask Penny for change right on the sides of these streets all the time, trying to get money and panhandling and everything. It's a hard life. Yeah, yes, sir, it is. And he probably thought he was, you know, probably he was working, I'm pretty... And now he was intoxicated, wasn't he? I suspected that as much. Uh, he he does appear to be intoxicated. Um, he probably thought he was working and thought he was doing something right, but he's so drunk he don't even know his way from Tuesday. Right, right, yeah. He and he did have some uh, some marijuana on him, so he he could have been smoking too. Oh, I didn't know all that, and I don't I don't allow my construction workers to do anything while they're working because that's a liability for us. You, you know they can't right. they can't come on work site when they're drunk and they can't come work site when they're uh when they they've been smoking or any drug related because then that causes liability for us and if right. we and suspect I, it we send them home and I'm not too concerned about uh um the marijuana just just want to make sure that he understands that he's not supposed to be here and you know oh. he was saying that it, that you said it was okay because you guys are old buddies. Oh, no, I did not say it was okay, or I wouldn't have asked him repeatedly, at least after the first time he'd think he would listen, but he didn't. Right, right. Okay. Let's see. I um, just want to make sure I got all my information right here. I'm sure you're not too concerned with marijuana. I'm just talking to you. No, no, yeah, you're all good. Um, so you guys gonna you guys going to do some work here at the motel then? I guess we'll continue up. We'll get what we need to get done. I was trying to get some jackhammering going, and I had a buddy who was one of my workers, at least, was around here somewhere. He probably went off for... I think he went and picked up lunch. Maybe he'll come back. I don't know. If he don't come back, he getting fired. <laughs> I can I understand that. Uh, that that bicycle right there, is that... Uh, that, that was his. That was something okay. he rolled up on. If you want, I can call County and come get it if you want. If you want to do it, I, I don't, it don't matter to me. Yeah, no, that's fine. If you, uh, you know, if you want to have it taken care of, that's fine. Yeah, I can call County and I'll have him come by here and pick it well, up let, for you guys. Let me, uh, I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to take him in. Uh, we might just cite and release, and in that case, if he takes his bike and 
walks it away from here, he'll be all right. But um, I want to talk to him, the other deputy over there and see if he's got anything he wants to specifically do here. So all right. we'll get him. We'll definitely get him charged though for the the damage to your property and um, be it. We'll, uh, I guess just go from there. Yeah, just wanted to pay the property damages. Otherwise, I don't need to take it to court. Don't need to do anything like that. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. Appreciate you. I'll get I'll get this bike out of here. I'll call county for you. Okay. Yeah, uh, just hold off one second, though. I just want to talk to him real quick and see what his uh, what his story. Oh is, yeah, man. sure. Yeah, just... yeah. What you just you let me know what you need me to do, and I'll I'll okay. take care of it for you, man. You'll be around though. Yeah, I'll be around. I'll be right here. Okay. Sounds good. All right. You might have to come tap my shoulder, though. I'm gonna be jackhammering. I heard you over there. I'm like, I'm like a bug. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I told the cop who come over to talk to me, he said, uh, he said, uh, was that his bike? And I was like, yeah, that's the piece of shit he rolled up on. <laughs> but uh, I also said something to him that my other worker was here. I think he went and got food, but if he don't show up, he back show back up, he's fired. told him I had work permits, I had everything from the, uh, the town of Sandy Shores and everything from the mayor. Well, I don't think I went into that, that much detail. He didn't want to see all that. I was like, well, I've got it all here laid out on the truck hood. one that I see. Um, he said something about it. He said something about a site and release. Because I, I told him that to let me know if I needed to call county and I'd have that, I'd have that car, uh, 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 that bicycle removed. Say bicycle <laughs> Now you're talking like. <laughs> oh. I got stories on stories. Oh shit.
Yeah, what's up? Uh, not really. I didn't, I haven't noticed anything. So I'm not sure what he's hearing. I've, I've been over here working, smoothing out cement and everything. Are you right? <clears throat> That's usually where the trouble starts. I love how earlier you said I love how earlier you said, I haven't drank any, but uh, other than eight beers. No way, yep. Hey, Jethro. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, I just want to let you know he's going to be charged with the disorderly conduct and the uh, the drunken public there for, for his uh, actions here tonight. So, All right. A couple of misdemeanor charges. He's nothing major. He's going to go sleep it off in the drunk tank. Yeah. I wish better uh, for him, though. I hope he can change his life around. You know, this isn't, this isn't the biggest deal. It's just a... You know, it's going to be a pretty hefty fines for him for for being homeless. Hopefully he can uh, get his life cleaned up a little bit and get a job. Yeah. If he get his life cleaned up a little bit, I'd like to give him a job. I'd like to give him a chance, but... Uh, well, I'll, I'll let him know you said that. You know, maybe maybe this will be a little bit of an awakening for him. He, sometimes yeah. these things uh, can help more than they can hurt. Right, right. If, if you got a buddy that can uh, tow this bike out of here, I'll let you take care of that. Otherwise, I can... I can uh, call County Tow and have them come pick it up. Yeah, I got a buddy with County Tow. We got like a, we got like a partnership with them. I'll get them to, I'll get that okay. taken care of for you. Don't worry about it. You all get out of here and just deal with you. Got a, re you got rest of the night, you know. Yeah. Yep. All right. Sounds good, buddy. Have a good night. All right. You too. Be safe out there. Yeah. You too. Watch, watch, uh, falling objects here. This place is.
Oh yeah. Or shave. Why do you think we have hard hats? It's not just for <laughs> it's just not for rats that fall around. It's for all kinds of shit that falls. Definitely. <laughs> all right, man. You have a good night. All right, you too.